Hey guys, what's going on here today and welcome back to episode 2 of the Reading Career Mode guys. And yeah, today we have got some different signings. I think we even start off with some games now, look. We're in here now with some friendlies. So we've got Porto here in the first game that we are going to be playing. And yeah, you can see here, we're loading it up. And we start off here with our Unal, our new striker front. His name's Unal. Um, Obviously, we've had a bid for Bella, and hopefully we can get that accepted very soon. Fernandez has started as well, but yeah, this should be out probably on the Tuesday night. Um, yeah, I'm going to have one of these out probably once every two days, so like Tuesday, Thursday, and then obviously on Saturday I'll have one out, and then I don't know after about that. We'll just see how it goes. Um, but yeah, so so for only one upload yesterday, but um, I didn't want to get too up because people still had school. I didn't want to like run a video like not really get many views on it. But you see here, James Wilson has actually signed for the club, so it's going to be a exciting guys that is going to be a lot of, lot of money like probably going to be worth if you can sign him at the end as well I should maybe put a fee in at the end to bomb but I wasn't sure I was going to want him or not so I just took the risk of um just putting him in for a season we don't really get to play him much this season I don't think we will anyway we've got a lot of other players that would rather use Hector Beller and though look at that they agree the deal 1.8 mil what a bargain that is I mean now guys basically all we need to do is just um Brandon Barker, I think, is all we're going to sign. Um, there's so many players that we're going to sign that are pretty good. Good youngsters. Zach Knight here, 34. I mean, he can go whenever he wants to. I ain't about him. Like, we don't need him. He's never been used. Like, he's never going to be used. So, you might as well just go on his travels, really, to somewhere else where he's going to get played because players like that are not going to fit in our club. Like, we need young talent. That's the idea of this. We're going to sign a lot of youngsters and then build our way up through the um, our championship, hopefully maybe get mid table this year and then um next season push for promotion but see how that goes you can see here now though chris gunder here comes out bellerin grows so quickly as well you might see him rating now i guarantee very soon you'll probably have like way more and jamie mack could play mackie here and mccleary left mid mccleary's preferred positions are left mid as well so i can play mackie and that benefits me as well and james wilson that can sit on the bench i think it's james and i keep again but it should hurt me on that as well and thanks to everyone who did watch the end of the video and that was really appreciated and like if you get to the end of this one i'm gonna tell you something else <laughs> so goes and obviously kind of done but let's see how much you watch of this actual video because this series like, i don't know how it's gonna go but i'm gonna try and get a lot of support on it and whatever hope we can keep loading it um, every couple of days because i'm enjoying just playing it through as long as you guys are enjoying but look at that we beat wolfsburg away from home i know they got a red card but that's not the point we beat Wolfsburg, um, you know, one 0 Great result, really. And the transfer for him after Zach Knight, two hundred and ten k. They said I just accepted it because let's be honest, he's going to get used. He's no, he's not good. I mean, what's he going to be useful for, really? So we'll just get rid of him and let him move on elsewhere. Yeah, um, hope you go sign some more players. But yeah, you can see now though. Here we're coming in, looking at cams from Arsenal. I just went to look just to see if there was anyone that I took my fancy, but there wasn't really. So um, yeah, I just left that. And now you'll see in a minute as well. We'll see some other players. Um, let's looking through just for cams and whatever of the actual team. So Oscar obviously is never going to sign. Like some obviously unrealistic. So I didn't even bother attempting to look at them. But Cameron Brannigan, Brannigan I was looking at, and I just thought, what's the point? There's no point. So we moved on with him. He's not very high rated, and we can sign someone much better. I'm sure of that. But yeah, now Ross Barkley here is going to be too expensive because. Um, and then I saw this guy here, this um, Andres Pereira. I checked on Foot Ido's rating because I wasn't sure. He's only 62 rated, which isn't going to benefit us whatsoever. Again, and then Philip Jurich is too expensive. James Ward Prowse, I knew they'd want a lot of money for him, but I thought, why not try him and see how that goes? Um, let me search for him. I've got Club Bruges coming up very soon. That's going to be a pretty big game. So I went Jonathan Moyes, £7 for him. We would offer like £2 million, £1 million, something like that. I didn't want to offer much because that's only a stupid price that they asked for in there. So I like to start off really, really low and just build up slowly. I know it's stingy, but at the end of the day, it's not. I don't want to like spend too much on players. But we put Zach Knight in. I know he's going to be leaving for Blackburn, but hopefully, um, if he did accept that, we'd stop him going to Blackburn and get him to go there. But yeah, um, then now James Ward Prowse here, 6 mil, and you know, look at that though, Hector Bellerin. What a signing that is. I mean, that is going to be a massive um, signing over the next few years for him to be used as. He's going to get a massive break in that like, upgrade every time. I mean, I know he's one less rating than Gunter, but he'll definitely grow much harder. And obviously, just by the end of this season, about every 71 rated, 72 rated, something like that, which is absolutely insane. Um, he'll turn into probably the best right back in the league, probably in the Premier League, I mean, if you have to get there. But he's now uh, Stephen Kelly there, we can sell him on. Hey yeah, guys, I'm going to be simulating the games. I've put a decision because I don't really want to play them. Like, Would you rather watch me play them or would you rather like just me obviously simming them through and then um get to see more as well with me doing that i think so 
I can't do anything of doing that, but I don't know, it's up to you guys. I'd rather send them anyway. But um yeah, two goals inside ten minutes you know, exactly ten minutes. I don't know how that even happens, but yeah, they must have done like a run from kickoff by the looks of it if they're going that. But yeah, that was an interesting one at the end of the day. But yeah, we'll see. Now as well Josh Wilson does come on here and then um, yeah, it was getting a bit of a it was a bit of an interesting game really to be honest. Um nothing really happened until the end and then Obita decided to score in the eighty ninth minute and um we actually won, so that was pretty awesome. Another win in pre-season. Only lost one game in actual pre-season, which is pretty sick. But yeah, um, and now we just going to play a soul. It's, I don't know who this was at this point. I uh, could a few days ago. I recorded a couple of episodes um, a couple of days ago. Now we can see. Look, have to walk up against Brentford soon. But yep, Stephen Kelly there has um, gone, and you can see here now. I'm trying to pick up um, a new cam. I went to look here, and yeah, I've came up with this guy here. Um, Halilovic from Barcelona, um, we'll see what they wanted for him. He looks a very good sign and he looks like, um, at the moment his rating's like 72, but he's meant to grow a lot, so we'll see how that goes. Then obviously um, this guy as well, um, Egdan, uh, Egghan, something like that. Um, another one that's low rated and young and a big talent. Then obviously Adrian, um, this guy's a bit, this is my main target, Adrian, to try and pick up. If not, would go for Egdan probably, because Halilovic was going to be way too expensive, but I thought I'd try anyway. See what they actually said, but yeah, we went for Adrian was our main target, so we'll see how that went. We go a couple of days here now to the Tuesday night against Brentford. Um, look at that, no interest, he only recently joined, and Adrian only 4.7 mil. So I went in there with two, uh, 1.7, just sent back, see what they said. Um, I wasn't going to pay too much for him because obviously there's other players that I can buy, but he's obviously got a good rate and he can go up to like an 85, I think, which is sick. I know he didn't with 5 mil, and I want he was my second choice and he was more expensive. So I just offered them, I think, two staff, because it's a bit more expensive, but we could pay 300k extra. Um, I want two, but whichever one accepted, if either of them did. But we come now against Brentford in the Cup, our first important game. Obviously, Younel up front, hopefully, going to score us a lot of goals this season. He should do, really. He's a really big talent. Like I looked at his foot, I think he's got like an 86. That's insane, like an 86 rate player at Redden. But 2 on there. This guy here, I'm replacing this guy. He's a CD I'm playing in cam and he scores both goals. I was just like in shock, really. Now someone can do that from that. But yeah, he had, some very, he had a very hard game in the first game with a thingy. Um, championship, but um, yeah, they rejected the thing for Adrian, so I went in there with 2.3, um, I think 2.5 million. There you go. So we put that one in there, see what they'd say to that. I wouldn't really expect them to say yeah again, but we'll see how that one went. We skipped um, a day, I think, or two, um, letting it skip here now. The day after, and they want it too low and they can't accept your terms. So I put another for them because I wanted to get one of them, so I didn't want to have to wait too long. So I put 2.6 in for him as well. Um, both of them are going to similar ratings, but Adrian just has better skill moves, so I thought we'll try and get Adrian. And you see now, we just move yourself a bit now, so we have a little bit less wages, but we do have a bit more money. And we skip now to the um, Norwich game on the Saturday, and yeah, we go to sim this one as well, of course. Um, away from him against Norwich, that's going to be a very difficult game. I don't expect to get anything out of this. Maybe a draw, if anything, not obviously they'll win. But yeah, you can see here now, they've got a big team, and 1-1 one, one it was... Um, Bellerin scoring on his debut, what a signing, I mean he's meant to be a defender but he's scoring goals so that's always awesome, always a benefit, and then Hokakpan here, I'm not returning him, I mean I know he's low rated but he's only 23, he's going to be useful for like the bench when he gets injured or something like that, 3.6 mil tag for Adrian, so I gave up on Eggnan because what's the point, and then just put in 3.5, like, it, it was like it was fixed, like I had 3.5 on then the off one at 3.6, so I thought I'd send 3.5, I was expecting him to decline it, but you'll see here in a minute um, what actually happens, and you'll See, Trent he said 3.9 mil. I was like, I'm not interested in him for 3.9 mil. I'll offer 3.5. See what they say. But like, at the end of the day, I'd rather get if both accept and get an Adrian. That was my like mindset really of this. So we skip here. Look, and as you can see, they have accepted for Adrian. So he went in there with seven grand a week. Uh, important first team player and five years on his contract. So let's see how that one went. Um, yeah, guys. And um, what I want to say now is I want you to comment Adrian in the comment section if you have got to this part of the video. Just comment Adrian or Adrian. I don't know how you spell it, but yeah, comment that one down below if you've actually got to this point. That would be awesome if you could do that. I love that Adrian Wages got double the wages as well when he's the same rating. Like it's stupid, but I thought I'd send it anyway. Just in case Adrian didn't want to join, but um, yeah, you can see here now he wanted to join, and yeah, he's like 68 rated, I think, which is awesome. He's already growing like now as we speak. Like as I was doing this coming the other day again. 
and my voice is starting to go now sorry about that I've just been talking for 10 minutes solid but yeah um, make sure you smash that like button as well guys if you are new around here don't forget to subscribe as well comment down below if you can smash 10 likes for this I'll get another one out in two days time if not I'll get one out at the weekend but yeah um, thanks so much for watching and I'll see you all next time but first of all guys I want to just say that is a team and yeah next episode we have got Rotherham I think away so that should be a pretty easy game maybe to get some points in but yeah guys see you all next time